All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of Into the Mind of Throne, a series where I take you guys into my head and talk through a full live raw game of John Madden football. Not hopping into the gameplay quite yet today. We have 96 overall, Tony Romo, and I want to talk about him for a second, guys. He gets Gunslinger and Hot Rot Master. Probably the first usable Gunslinger and Hot Rot Master quarterback we've gotten. Peyton Manning was like 52 speed. That's not usable. Tony Romo, on the other hand, is at 82 speed. Okay, with 95 throw power, 95 throw under pressure, 94 for all the accuracy ratings. He's six foot two. He does have low throw on the run. Okay, it's 83. But that can easily be alleviated by spending one AP on sideline dead eye, or he also gets long range dead eye. Both of these are very good. A lot of the throw on the runs that I ask my quarterback to make are typically deep crossers or deep posts, which are both to the sidelines and long range. And even if you're throwing those on the run with sideline or long range dead eye equipped, they're going to be automatically accurate. So throw on the run rating really doesn't matter. That for one AP plus gunslinger for five and hot round master for two. I am spending eight AP on Tony Romo today, but trust me, you save so much because of the two AP hot round master. So earlier with my team, I was spending two AP on tight end apprentice for Kyle Pitts. I was spending one AP on backfield master for Roger Craig. That was a new one. I was testing it out, but I did like it. I love having those running back out routes. And then I also had a one AP slot apprentice on Cliff Branch, who's not even in my team now because I don't need a slot archetype wide receiver because I have hot route master. Yeah, I was spending four AP on hot routes just for three positions. Now with hot route master, I get every hot route for only two AP. And with that extra AP, I was able to go out and afford a couple of post ups. I'm going to try two post ups today. You know, Tony Romo isn't as mobile as Randall Cunningham. I'm probably going to have to pass a little bit more from the pocket. It's nice to get some extra blocking when, you know, your opponent's only sending three. I'm going to get shedded less up the middle with these two post ups. They're going to get double teams, okay? Obviously, if your opponent's sending pressure, you're not going to get double teams. You're going to have single teams across the board. You're going to have to make a read quickly, okay? But they're going to have fewer, fewer guys in coverage. It'll be easier. I think post ups are really good. I'm excited to use them again. Tony Romo, by the way, is is the Rich Gannon from last year. Fingers crossed I don't end up hating this dude as much as I hated Rich Gannon. I hated that guy. Might as well talk about the rest of the lineup, I guess, too. Uh, the defense, you can see most of the players here. I have some players in my specialists, too. But in terms of abilities, I'm rocking six acros right now. And then the three AP Cordero Patterson forces me to have one extra AP. So I'm spending that on a mid zone on Ty Law. I guess I also have one step ahead on Cordero Patterson, too. And today's an Inside the Mind episode. So we're going to talk a lot about the gameplay. So playbooks are super important. Multiple defense defensive playbook guys both ebooks are going to be linked in the description on hotroute.tips if you want to see exactly every single play that i call in this video it's going to be on there if you want to be a better madden player that is the place to be just become a member you'll get access to both of these ebooks anyways guys tony romo inside the mine let's get into the gameplay let's do it oh god this guy's got a 98 overall peyton manning okay as i mentioned okay tony romo this is it's a much better card than that peyton manning peyton manning's a tortoise let me show let me show you let me show you how much better romo is than manning watch me come out right here and have a xerxes game watch me throw 12 for 23 and and just barely scrape out a win in rookie division i love xerxes slander can't lie oh sorry so i'm starting the game with a pooch kick um Oh, wait, I love kicking to the up back. It's just, I don't want to give up easy TDs, like free TDs. That's the quickest doubles Y flex call I've ever seen. Okay, I'm going the dollar. Hold up. Um, you're going to see me call a lot of dollar and a lot of 335 wide. So I like calling or putting Mike Blitz 3 as an audible in wide. And because uh, I audible from normal to wide. And then let's just come out in dollar with stock zone drops to start it off. Because, hey, why not? And I'm going to shift my D line away from the running back. Specifically to try to help out with a little run D against inside zone. He actually gets seven yards off it though, which is rough. That's some zone drops. Curl flats five, flats 20, strong Y off. This dude's going to give me a tour. Okay, well, um, let's get good D lineman out here. Wilbur Marshall, Jason Taylor, Jonathan Abraham. Now let's do it. All right. And I am shifting my D line. I think he's going to probably run dive. Probably dive. No, he's passing. He's passing. Yeah, I'm spreading my D line and I'm not containing. I'm not containing Peyton Manning. Pretty much never will. Why would I ever contain Peyton Manning? He's throwing up a streak to his 99 speed. Michael Irvin, make a play, Ronnie. Why is it always Ronnie? Oh man, Ronnie can't catch. I've got to get him. I got to get him off the field. I'm getting Cordero out there first off. Second off, we got to get Ronnie gone. I need to figure out someone to replace him with. I need to change theme teams. That's what it is. Gun split close. Let's put our flats on five. And let's send, let's send the dogs right here. Let's send the dogs. A little cover two blitz, actually. A vert hook there on Ronnie in the slot. And I am going to contain him, but that's the blitz, okay? That's not me. Running the coverage right at the flat. That's not me containing to contain Peyton Manning. That's that's the blitz. It needs it. And I'm making a cover two shell again. Same defense. Take the middle of the field. And good play, Calvin. Thank you. Good start. You guys are going to see me call a lot of bunch, a lot of tray, a lot of tight, and then a lot of bunch head end too. I'm going to come out and bunch head end pretty much every single play. And audible. 
to the other sets that I have. So like right here, I'm coming out and bunch that in. Let's go to gun tray. Why not? He's in two, four, five. Probably cover three. The stockest of cover threes, actually. So Perfect. just make a read. We're going to have all day. I can't blitz out of this either. Well, he can, but most people won't online. You're playing a really good player if they're actually blitzing out two or five and he's going to quit. All right. Good start. That's a no trigger spin with Kyle Pitts, by the way. I spin with him. I don't truck. I love just no triggers. Just tap the B button. Kyle Pitts will make people miss. Bunch off set. Oh, I've got a sweat. Oh, I've got a freaking sweat here. All right. Why does it say I have linebackers in a dollar? Why do I have linebackers? I'm going to go offside. So we'll see if he declines it. Oh, I accidentally called a, a certain sub package. I flicked my right stick. All right. This is better. Okay. All right. First and five though against bunch offset. I got to stand about right here. He also has Romo, which is, this is perfect. This is perfect. Little Romo on Romo. I got to stand about right here to shoot inside zone. It's going to four verticals to start the game. Good play call. Good tackle, Derwin. Just trying to mix up what we're doing against Bunch. I really don't want to run the same defense twice in a row ever against it. I'm going to run cover three cloud this play. That's why you'll see me changing my zone drops pretty much every single play against Bunch. He goes to curl flat. Threw it late. I actually wonder if I could have played it. I don't know. It's pretty close. I'm going to send pressure here. Well, five yard flat, send pressure. This is super risky. Super, super risky. Fingers crossed, man. I got to use the deep middle if I... It's just... Double post. Good tackle. All right. He's probably going to no huddle. Nope, he didn't. Okay. Let's change our zone drops again. Let's change our zone drops. Check out just 10 flats. Yeah, let's just go 10 flats this time. We need the pressure to come home. Pressure comes home. We're in a good spot. He's not in field goal range either. So. One. Why do I have Aaron Glenn on my field? That should be Cordero in that spot. I got to make a sub quickly. Am I an idiot? Yeah. Cordero needs to be out there. Doesn't matter. He would have converted regardless, but that's bad. All right. Let's set our flats on 20. Curl flats on five. Put an inside third on my right safety. Lurk. No, I had a perfect lurk. I had a perfect lurk. No, can I get my stop? I just need one stop to beat this guy. If I get one stop, I win, and I'm not going to get it. Damn it. All right. Flats on five. I got to go to wide now. I got to go to wide because I need to make sure I stop the run. I feel most comfortable stopping it. Out of wide. A little hook curl there. Good play. All right. Well, gave up seven after that. It's fun. Love it. I do a game play on a card and we're both using them. We both have Tony Romo. I love that. Oh, he's running me in. Okay. Well, I'm going to run boot over with the Texas route then. A lot of yards. As long as Romo can make this throw, he can. Okay. I drop back a little bit too far. When you drop back, I think it's, it's 10 or 15 yards past the line of scrimmage. I think it's 15. You lose your buttons. So you got to be really careful. And normally when you do that, it's going to end up being an, ina an inaccurate ball. So I'm going to be really careful of dropping back too far. I'm going to block my tight end here. Let's go dual crossers. We call this spaceship. Two crossers. I'm throwing it my flat. Just want to make sure I get the ball off. That's really all I care about. Taking sacks against man coverage is miserable. So you just got to be careful. Roger Craig's tired. Let's get Bo out there for a play. Audible to gun Trey. Let's see what he does against this. Marshall's wide open. Good ball, Tony. Good release, Tony. I probably shouldn't have spun there, but I like that. Way to get the ball out quick. He's been man pretty much every single play. So I'm trying to give myself as many man beating routes on the field as possible. I'm trying to give myself like a running back out route, running back Texas routes, slants, crossers, stuff that I know that's going to do a really, really good job of beating man. Um, I need to make sure I have on the field literally every single play right now because he's calling man every play. I don't like this play call by me. Well, I'm getting time though, thankfully. It's fine though. Throw away off. That was a horrible play call. Love motion against man too. So you're not gonna get pressed. Psych. Robbie drops it. It's fine. All right, big down here. Oh, I know what I'm doing. I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. I gotta play. I don't know if he's. I think he's shading underneath. I really haven't paid attention to be honest. But if he is, Robbie should be a touchdown. He's not. It's a low ball. A catch it. Perfect. Low ball with the left trigger. All right. Still a good drive. It's going to go to the quarter. 12 yard line's hard. That's a hard yard line to score from. All right. Um, you guys know the play who watched the channel. I'm going to tight. And I'm sending out five. It's a touchdown. All right. Not too bad. We just need one stop this game and I win. I'm not losing to this guy. Uh, if, uh, if I get a stop. Kick's going to be up. Kick's going to be good. Accurate kick. Little sky kick. Okay, that's Mark Andrews. Can somebody de decapitate this dude? Please, somebody hit him hard. Never mind. We tried. Ooh, D. Click on to Ronnie. I'm trying to make a play. Yes. Ty Law. Picks. E, 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 e.
Dog shit. <laughs> no, it's fine. That is open. So gave the same four verticals tight end wheel route to him twice. So I'm an idiot. He's going to get a goal line here. I form close. I'd rather play against this. All right. Tackles, 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 tackles. Hold him to three. Hold him to three. We are fine. If I hold him to three, I win. The two yard line is way easier to get a stop than the one. The one, you could, it just takes one fall forward and they're in the end zone. All right. He might run inside zone here. I'm trying to decide how I want to defend this. Yep, he did. He did. He did. He did. I'm there. I am there. Okay. Shifted my D line towards the running back. It's my best chance to be able to shoot the run. And we shot it. All right. So here we go. Tight end, tight end, tight end, tight end, tight end. I manned him up with the safety, by the way, and he got freaking cooked by Jamal. All right, give me my rock. Or he cooked Jamal, rather. But thankfully, we knocked it out. I knew he was going to four verticals. That's all he's called in the red zone. All right, didn't take a rocket scientist to figure that out. Just putting a drag out of PA boot over. And throw to Kyle Pitts. What is... This is the this is a weird Madden game. What is going on? All right, we just need to go score. Score points in general. Make sure he doesn't see this ball back. Um, obviously seven better than three, but it shouldn't be hard to milk either because this is going to be a long drive. I have to go 88 yards. Robbie Anderson time. That's Robbie. That's Robbie, man. You got to watch out for that dude. He has deep route KO. Okay. Well, good to know. Oh, that's no fun. Should have looked at his abilities. He has deep route KOs instead of acros. Yeah, deep route KOs. This, those are some random abilities. He has a random one step. All right, whatever. Just get someone open, please. For the love of God. Ugh. Wasn't sure if Y was going to get open or not. Thankfully, we have a little bit of mobility with Romo. We can scramble. That helps out a lot. He's in man every single play right now. Just beat man. Just beat man. Just beat man. Kyle Pitts on an out route. We'll take it. I'm going to no huddle here. I'm not super worried about the clock quite yet. Should I try to throw it to Robbie again? See if the steep route KO goes crazy one more time? This is a terrible idea. This is a horrible idea. This is how you lose games. No. Nah. It's fine. We got Kyle wide open. One jurtle, one spin. We're out of bounds. Beautiful. I love having Hot Rod Master. I freaking love this. Let's go to gun tight. Let's go to gun. Let, let's do this. Let's go to uh, flood. I want to call flood, not four birds. Call the wrong play. Robbie. Robbie's the best. Oh, I'm an idiot. Bad swerve by me. I was trying to get a dive catch so it wouldn't get knocked out from behind, but I probably had space where I didn't have to do that. It's fine, dude. It's fine. Okay. Check down to our running back. Check down to our Bo Jackson. One time out here. Okay. Well, this is fringe field goal range right now. Let's get Roger Craig back out there. He should have been out there the whole time. I'm an idiot. Wasting an ability point. So the reason why I don't want to throw this deep post to Robbie now, because he has universal coverage on, on that corner. So let's flip this. Let's do it to let's do it to Brandon Marshall. Something like this. Something like this. B Marsh. B Marsh. A catches. Yes, yes, yes. It didn't get knocked out. Thank you. Thank you, Brandon. Thank you. Touchdown, touchdown, touchdown. Oh, and Romo fumbles the snap. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's the downside of having Tony Romo right there. Dude, just cost me a point. I might lose because of that. I am ass for that swerve catch that I screwed up, by the way. Like, really, really ass. I'm bad for that. That was, ooh, that was embarrassing. It's fine, though. We still got our seven. Picks. No, it's fine. It's cool. He's probably going to get three, actually, because I'm ass. That was a perfect Y curl call. Damn it. Flood was an interesting play call, and it's going to get him points, too. Uh, I had it bagged. He just got time. I mean, he's getting blitzed this play. I don't know what he's doing calling another play. Hold him to three. All right. That was horrible defense. That was a horrible drive by me. Lots of man beating Rouse in the field. He is running man. He is never sending pressure right now. He is just running stock man with as many guys in coverage as possible. I could really call the same place every single play. I just want out routes. I want tight end posts. I want slants. I threw this late. Perfect. Thankfully still got it. Threw that a little bit late. Welcome to the man coverage beating simulator. Come on, Robbie. Beat this shit underneath. He didn't. It's fine. Check down. It's never going to be picked there. Could play Roger Craig. Still take our yards. We need seven here. I really badly need seven. Three and we're only up six. Game's super losable. I do have red zone throw on Brandon Marshall. If I get single team, I could I could technically just chuck it. Like I could really just let it fly. He's gonna catch that no matter what, by the way. Even if he triggers an animation where his or his DB gets over to try to knock it out, it's it's not gonna happen. I have red zone threat. One on one, inside the 20, in man. You're pretty much never ever ever gonna drop it. Just highball it, go up Y, catch it, dunk on him. 
celebrate. All right, man, one stop. It's GG's. Get me the hell out of this one. Poor Nick Folks back there getting just clobbered on the kickoff team. Oh, man. I have an inside third on the right side. I have, if he just has a streak on his ISO side wide receiver, it's just a touchdown. It's a TD from hell. Ugh. Never mind. All right. I'm doing the same thing. I'm doing the same damn thing. This dude's the best double spinner I've ever played against. Oh my gosh. All right. Can I get a stop here? Thank you, Vert Hook, for playing that. I was going to say, if you don't play that, you're off the team, Derwin. I'm just lurking the tin and wheel. Good knockout, Jamal. I feel like there have been so many balls that I could have picked off, and I just I haven't picked anything off here. Okay, he's going to gun tight slots. I wish I knew how I wanted to defend this. Probably play coverage. Probably play coverage out of dollar. Play the running back, please. Play the running back, please. Play the running back, please. He went to what, exactly what I did. Throwing to his, uh, his deep in elite. Keyshawn Johnson. I'm assuming that's not red zone threat, but on the same post that I threw to Brandon Marshall last draft. Just go score seven, okay? Go score seven. It's GG's. Game's over. What the hell is this play call by me? These gushers taste so damn good. I'm obsessed. Scramble. Good job, Rama. Ugh. We are going to the quarter. I want as little time left in this game as possible when he gets this ball back. It's man every play. Man coverage. Literally every play. I got screamed at by a four-man rush. All right. Oh, I got this. Hold up. I got this. Yes. <laughs> Roger Craig. Yes. On the Texas route. I forgot. Just use the Texas route. Okay. I live in Texas. Use the Texas route. Abuse the Texas route. That should be my favorite route in Madden, man. I forgot how good Texas routes are against me. Forgot. That's the reason why I put on Backfield Master a few days ago for this weekend league. Good catch, Keyshawn. And touchdown. Touchdown. And GG's. Game's over. All right, guys, kicking the ball off first. Pooch kicking, you know the drill. Sky kick to the up, man. He's got a fullback there, okay? He's not going to return it for a kick return touchdown. This is going to be... He's got a fullback there, okay? I want to kick it to him. We have a good shot for a hit stick. And he intelligently gets down. Doesn't take a hit. Smart. Defensively, you're going to see me run a lot of 3-3-5 wide, but I come out in 3-3-5 normal and audible to it. So I'm going to set an audible here. Mike Blitz 3. Then you might see me run a lot of dollar too. I really like running dollar. He's in Y off trips, Pat. So he's running U trips. I'm going to get Cordero Patterson out wide. Let's get Ronnie Lott here to the slot. Okay. I think I'm going to run dollar against this. Little five curl flats, 20, 20 flats to start. Yeah, let's do that. And then I'm going to shift my line away from the running back pretty much every single play. And I'm just going to start it off the double Mabel, guys. A purple and a blue on each side out of cover two. And we got to lurk up the seam just in case. Yeah, I'm going to go up. Good dot. I was going to say I have to follow the crosser there, but we're fine. Five yards first play, not too bad. Oh, and he's no huddling. Oh, oh boy. And so this guy has Dan Marino, by the way, with the Raiders theme team. This is a cover two beater. I, I'm not going to get to it. I can maybe make maybe make a tackle. That's a huge tackle. This is a hard area to score. Okay, we're fine with we're fine with that tackle. This isn't this is a really hard area to score. Okay, so getting that tackle could end up being huge. I'm actually gonna decide to send some pressure at him. Let's 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 blitz five out of uh out of wide. It's a post and a wheel. Post and a wheel. No, it's not. Tackles here. Tie lot. Damn it. I'm bad. Good start for my opponent. Good start. I'm not blitzing. 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 Oh, Ed Reed doesn't have acro, so he's not going to play it. Ah, oh. one yard line. He's probably just going to go to really trips head end. So he's going to, he's going to run base here. It's going to be base. I'm just run committing it. Yeah. He RPO'd. Good play. Really good first drive for him. We got to, this dude's hell. This good. This guy's decent. I love a good sweaty inside the mind video. I love it. It's so hard to talk about what I'm doing versus somebody that I'm just having an easy time with that I can just run the same offensive and defensive plays basically for an entire game. Whereas against someone like this, you're gonna have to think a little bit more. Okay, it's a little bit of a cat and mouse game, a little bit of a chess match. And you're gonna see me come out in bunch tight end pretty much every single time that I call an offensive play. And then I'm gonna audible to other forms. I'm gonna go to bunch. I'm gonna go to gun tray. I'm gonna go to gun tights. Okay, I'm gonna throw to the flats. All right. He's playing, he's running three, three, five wide. I didn't get any yards. It's fine. I'm actually going to go to, I was going to say I'm going to go to four verticals, but I'm not. Let's go to Trey here. Let's spread him out a little bit. My four verts would be on the short side of the field if I did. And he's just running three, three, five normal to wide, kind of like I did for a little bit there. He just got zero yards. Checking down to the flats two plays in a row. I mean, I'm a freaking baby. Four yards total. Oh, I'm going to four verticals here and I'm blocking my tight end. One of the hardest play calls to stop out of wide. Very difficult play call to stop. Trey! Get my running back for a first down. I'm on a fourth down to start the damn game. Oh, that felt nice. Screaming into this mic. I have my good mic now that I'm back in Texas. All right, here we go. Fourth and five for my life, man. 
It's wide open because he doesn't have a freaking flat there. Ugh. Thankfully got time. Sent six. Rough start, okay, but it's fine. It's all right. We're good. I'm sending out five routes here, and he has been blitzing pretty much every single play out of wide. I like that defense versus bunch head end, by the way. You'll see me do that whenever I play bunch head end. I love sending the the tight end side corner out of wide it comes in hot sometimes i think a wheel route would be better against it then so like let's send out five at the same play but let's do it with a wheel route this time it's so hard to ever lurk a wheel route i have this out route here with brandon marshall one truck ouch 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 it's gonna go to the quarter all right that is the fastest quarter of madden i've ever seen in my life 25 yard line kind of crosser range to be honest i should probably try to score on a crosser here right second and one i feel decent about taking a shot block this please block it 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 ran commit so just gave me everybody run commit also pretty much it doesn't come in like you're gonna get all day this year so don't throw a ball immediately don't panic you're gonna have time if you see a run commit all right don't throw anything stupid in the past run commits used to continue running at the qb so they would just sack you after like a second so you actually had to make like a fast read this year if you see a run commit take your time do not panic okay you're not gonna get sacked all right man can i get a damn stop now one stop i win this game i'm pretty confident one stop i win the game that's all it takes sometimes in madden 22. yeah and i'm gonna run wide i am gonna run wide against this guy i'm gonna do it with the pinch d line too well that's not uh, that's fine i wish i would have had a five yard flat maybe i need to go to five yard flats make him throw over him i'm just gonna protect the sticks then so it, it will be a five yard flat technically he's got nothing he has absolutely nothing he's caged Make him work for this. Make him work for it. Five yard flats, five hooks, maybe. Should I hit him with some surprise man? Let's do surprise man. Let's hit him with surprise man. Ronnie, damn it, Ronnie. I shaded over top too, so it's 97 speed on 97 speed. I need to figure out when you can throw streaks and when you can't. I don't get it. I still don't. On my second channel a few days ago, I guess it was yesterday, my opponent recovered a f onside against onside recovery like this. So I'm terrified every single time my opponent comes out and onside now. Yes, against onside recovery. And he's only onsiding, so then I can't milk him. Which isn't true, by the way. I can milk him if I want to. Should I milk him? Should I? Should I? Should I be a loser? Is that what I should do since you're onsiding? Since you're the one doing it? I would have just scored normally. But no, if you really want the ball back that bad, fine. I'll milk you. I'll milk the shit out of you. I'll squeeze your nipples till they turn purple, all right? Give me my shit, all right? Run commit me all you want getting the first down third and one is beautiful i have two chances to get a first down i'm gonna be fine right it's being smart it is madden 22 it's really hard to get stops he probably recognizes he can't get stops against me so him having the ball last is his best chance to win where now i could score seven with like less than 20 seconds left and you know i'm in a spot to come on roger craig I'm in a spot to have ball at half in a tie game. Now I'm in the driver's seat if I can handle this correctly. So that is the point of milking here, which hey, a lot of people don't like, but I think he's in man. He is not. Perfect. Literally perfect in terms of milking. Literally. And I don't want to say we go now. We can't score a TD yet, but we can check down a few plays. We'll be fine. Ooh, Tony, 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 Tony. Get after it, Tony. Of course, he's going to call timeout. Smart, smart. I'm going to go to mesh spot. Good read. Perfect. And I need as many yards here as possible. Perfect. I don't want to just barely get the first down because I'm on the four yard line. Like, well, sorry, because I'm going to be first in goal. So getting more yards, getting to the four yard line. A lot better than I just accidentally chewed clock. Inside the mine, I do something stupid. I need to get this seven really badly now. Touchdown. All right, he had nobody manned up on the running back. He didn't even get close to this user. All right, so we scored seven with 12 seconds left still, even though I handled that incorrectly. Like, I, I milked it perfectly until the very end. Like, I, I turned into an idiot. It's fine, though. He cannot get seven here at all. He can maybe get three if he just ends up calling a couple a couple god plays. He gotchas me, maybe, but I should be fine in terms of not allowing points here. Nice little pooch kick. Hopefully, waste a couple seconds. He should have, like, 10 seconds. It's a big hit from Marshawn, too. We could have gotten the ball back. All right. And he's in trips. Okay. So we know the play he's calling. It's going to be a deep skinny post from uh, from Moss here. Nope. It is not. He can't get in the field range now. So we're good. That is not a good play call. I don't agree with that. You guys know this Hail Mary. It's Moss on a deep uh, a deep post. Never mind. He just put all streaks and has thrown it deep. Okay. 
Well, called out two plays there and just wasn't either of them. I mean, it was the play, but he didn't set it up correctly. All right, now he's kicking deep. Let's have a good drive. Let's have a nice, easy, simple, good drive. I want this to be like four plays and seven, maybe eight. I might go for two, put a little pressure on him. And get down, no hits, we're fine. That's just spamming the hell out of the X button to get down. And I'm going for my first big play here. It's not open, but I have a check down. Brandon Marshall's wide open on a zig. This dude is sending pressure every single play. Every play. He's got to mix it up. We got to we gotta try to catch me off guard sometimes, man. We can't blitz every play. Tony isn't quite fast enough to outrun the blitzer there. Randall probably does for long enough for me to throw my touchdown. Because my deep skinny post there is a TD. I don't think I like this play call. I think he's going to send everybody at me and I'm going to be screwed. Getting my crosser though. I got enough time. Thank God. 13 for 15, 154 with Romo. That is so nice that I'm able to, oh, having Hot Rot Master, I'm able to choose which guy to put my crosser on, which is really nice. Cause sometimes I like it the outside guy. Sometimes I like it the slot guy. Going to the send five out play. Uh, he finally actually, I have a CD though. No, it's tight. Ah! It's good though. Wow, laser. Um. He finally actually played coverage. That was the first time I think all game he's he's really played coverage. Maybe the second time. There have been a couple times he's he's only sent a, a few. Right there, he didn't blitz me. It was a five play drive, but we, hey, we'll take it. We'll take the seven. I'm drinking Mountain Dew and eating Gushers right now. How could I lose? I'm gonna go five flats. I think he might chuck the ball at a flat. He really might. And I'm gonna manually back off B every single play. That's Y, A, B, and up on the right stick to manually back him off. No! Oh! Oh, he thought I was gonna take the deeper post. I stuck with the with the slant. I had that lurked. How was that not picked? That was so into coverage. Jeez. Can I get some pressure, please? Bad throw from, from Marino. Jeez. I'm gonna go back to five hooks, five curl flats, 20 flats. I'm gonna run cover two here. Just send three. So with my D lineman and a three rack, actually, I'm sending two. Thought my three rack might play that. I'm an idiot. This is D. D, 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 defense. Stock cover three here. Ronnie, 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 Ronnie. <sighs> Third and 20, what's the play call here? Probably 25 flats. I'm gonna go cover two at 25 flats. I'm taking the whole right side of the field. Get over Scream, here. let's go, I sent six. I did exactly what I talked about earlier against Bunch Head End um, that he did. I've gotta get my guy backed off. There we go. With 25 flats, I should be good to not call a timeout. Just stay deep. The running back wheel route. We're fine. Make a tackle. Yeah, we're good. All right. I did what I talked about earlier against uh, what he did against Bunch Tight End, sending the tight end side corner while you send five, turning it into sending six. That play or uh, that like little mix in can be really, really good. It screams. He's probably going to do it against me right here. Watch it. Yeah. See. Take one read. And this is going to the quarter. He wanted to milk me earlier. Hey. We can, we can have a milk off, man. I'm the best milker around. So I got my stop, thankfully. I finally did it. Probably probably should have gotten it a little bit sooner. I did I did lurk him. I've never really run this play like this. What if I motion out a drag here? It was just shaded over top, man. So I knew I could throw that. Just a little four yard gain, but we got to take it. So we need like four more yards to be in field range. We are outside though here at MetLife. There might be wind. There might be. I'm going to flood. Good catch, Kyle Pitts. Is that a first? Give me a first. Give me a first. First down. I'm going for a bomb here. I'm going for a bomb. I'm going for it all. I mean, we know he's blitzing me. He's blitzing every single play right now, but they run away. A little bit of a slow throw away from, from Romo there. Kind of worries me. I haven't called this yet. I haven't called my spot yet. It's a laser. That's a field goal. Let's go. Let's go. That was all I needed, baby. It was all I needed. I got Nick Folk. This dude's got a, a freaking... A freaking leg kicks up, kicks good. Great hold, James Morgan. And we're gonna be up 10. All right, 214 left. Uh, he's lost a timeout already. So if I get the ball back, I can automatically milk 30 seconds. Um, yeah, we just need to make this drive take as long as possible here. A little too safe of defense? I really hope not. And we gotta watch for a deep skinny post from Moss right here. That is probably the play he's going to. Nope. Well, it does have a deep skinny post actually, but yeah, no. Picks. Let's go. Cordero Patterson making a freaking play after we made a video on him yesterday. Now let's go have a good drive. Put it, put the nail in the coffin. The few incompletions I've thrown this game have just been odd. Like, 
Okay, I'm only throwing to wide open players and getting the ball swatted. Going to do it again. I'm going to flood two out routes. Shocker, it's wide open again. Roger Craig, let's go, buddy. It's not a first, but it's fine. Oh, I like my play call a lot here. I like it a lot. Cross or slant. Touchdown. Nobody's manned up on Marshall. Game over. And touchdown, touchdown. Why win? Touchdown, touchdown. And GG's. Guys, that's going to be it for this video. Uh, Tony Romo, probably the best quarterback in all of Madden. This dude is awesome. I love the ability to be able to have all the extra AP uh, for a couple post-ups, for catching abilities, for route techs, whatever you want to use on offense. In addition to having Gunslinger and every single hot route in the game, you can't, you can't compete with that. We'll see. I'm probably going to use him for an entire weekend league. I'll make a decision between him or Randall Cunningham. I think they're both really, really good. I think Boomer's also really good. But this card basically makes Dan Marino just completely obsolete. Regardless, if you enjoyed the video and you're not subscribed yet, please consider hitting the subscribe button. It's free and you can always unsub at any time. And of course, my eBooks are on hotroute.tips linked in the description. Full offense, full defense. Every play I ran today is there. If you want to become a better Madden player, that is the place to be. Guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.